approach one browser like chrome browser whatever it is in the google chrome i am like uh, sending some keys like selenium what is that selenium go to the selenium link here we are seeing that https www.selenium dev link to that selenium click on the selenium click on the selenium now we are seeing this is the one of the interface we are seeing here now click on the downloads click on the downloads in the downloads in the downloads we are seeing that latest stable version of selenium so first we need to download the jar what is meant by jar jar is nothing but a storage purpose in the jar we are storing some packages uh, like uh, already selenium will be stored some packages and predefined class it will be stored in this jar now i am click on this 4.4.0 now let us see here selenium server jar will be downloaded let us see here selenium server 4.4.0 jar was downloaded successfully okay after the downloadation we don't want to do anything just scroll up scroll up the page here we are seeing the browsers here we are seeing the browsers option click on this browsers here we are seeing the lot of browser directs okay now as a user perspective we need to approach lot of browsers here i am approaching some browsers one is first i am downloading here chrome to download the chrome driver click on this documentation and here let us see this is the latest beta release beta release is nothing but a under construction it was not market wise release it was been in a under construction beta release is nothing but already we seen that in user acceptancy testing in that user acceptancy testing it is the one of the testing site we are seeing in a uh, like a user acceptancy testing beta testing is one of the thing here we are downloading the latest stable release chrome driver 105th version here we are downloading the latest stable release click on the latest stable release now now we are seeing this type of interface here we need to select our operating system what is our operating system here one is linux and mac and windows our operating system is windows so we need to download this chrome driver underscore win 32 మనం ఇక్కడ ఏది డౌన్లోడ్ చేయాలి మనది విండోస్ సిస్టమ్ అయితే ఇది మీరు ఎవరైనా యాపిల్ కానీ వాడతా ఉంటే ఇది మ్యాక్ డౌన్లోడ్ చేసుకో ఓకే హియర్ ఐఎమ్ డౌన్ డౌన్లోడింగ్ దట్ క్రోమ్ డ్రైవర్ అండర్ స్కోర్ విండో థర్టీ టూ హియర్ ఇట్ వాస్ డౌన్లోడింగ్ ద జిప్ ఫైల్ విచ్ ఫైల్ ఇట్ ఈస్ జిప్ ఫైల్ ఓకే Okay, it was in still downloading not a problem we can download another thing okay after this downloadation zip file we need to go through the back and again back again in the downloads scroll up for, from until browsers now already we are downloaded that chrome browser here i am downloading firefox browser as well so as a user we need to first check in the chrome browser but here i am installing the firefox as well here click on the documentation and click on the geeko driver releases and scroll up scroll up scroll up here we are seeing the assets assets recently firefox they are released these things here what is our operating system geeko driver here i am downloading that 64 gb 64.64 64 bit here it should be downloading now zip folder was also downloaded here it should be downloading still
now this jar was downloaded and dot zip file uh, was downloaded and geeko driver dot zip file was downloaded now minimize now open the files where it should be downloading like uh, is my uh, it will be downloading in the downloads file here we are seeing the downloads here we are seeing downloads okay in the downloads this is the selenium server 4.4.0 and this is the geeko driver and this is the chrome driver these are the zip files which files it is zip files we can't do anything with using this zip files so we need to extract the zip files so right click right click and here some old laptop some laptops we are seeing the extract here option extract here options for some laptops in this laptops uh, not available that extract here we need to go through the extract all click on the extract all and click on the extract click on the extract now it extracted successfully and it should be giving geeko driver dot exe file this is the dot exe file now go to back and again we have that chrome driver zip file and right click and extract all click on the extract all and go through the extract now we are extracted successfully now we have a two extracted files in this folder we have a two extracted files and here i am going some google drive whatever it is new folder okay uh, here uh, storage was not enough uh, here i am using the c drive only but you guys must and should you need to prefer d drive or e drive why because for clarity purpose here i am creating the new folder new folder the folder name is selenium underscore sessions the folder name is selenium underscore sessions okay and here i am opening these downloads whatever i extracted okay here right click and then copy and go to the selenium sessions in the selenium sessions right click and then paste right click and paste or control v or yours and again go to the downloads and here we are found a chrome driver dot exe file right click and then sorry right click and then copy and then paste into selenium sessions paste okay this is the dot exe file and again go to downloads and in the geeko driver we are seeing that right click and sorry right click and copy and then paste into selenium sessions right click and then paste now we are separated that all drivers and jars like what we are seeing in, like we need to download the jars and drivers here i downloaded the jar and here i downloaded the browsers as well now i am opening some this eclipse id here now i have opened some eclipse id here i am creating the another project here i am create the another project file new java project here i am giving a name as a selenium basic selenium basics and i am going through the finish now i created a project to the project i am creating another folder new this is the folder folder the folder name is 
jars the folder name is jars and again i am creating another one folder new folder the folder name is drivers the folder name is drivers finish now i created drivers one folder jars one folder now right click uh, okay this is enough then i am going through the src to the src new and then package new package the package name is com.qa.basic this is the package name just i am going through and finish now i created a src basic and i am going right click new and then class class name is nothing but a selenium demo class name is nothing but a selenium demo and i am creating with main method now i am finishing the class environment now i found the class environment now today we need to know the program to launch browser automation browser automatically in with using the automation script like here one of the automation program use jc okay automation program you jc automatic a browser allow open jeta on a program to start okay now here i'm opening the files here i open the files here i am opening the selenium sessions in the c drive selenium sessions here and copying the both both drivers here i copied both drivers and right click on the drivers and paste now i was added successfully two drivers to the drivers folder and again i am opening the file here i am seeing the selenium server just i am going through the drag and drop to the jars okay here i added a jars to the jars folder now let us see here now here we are going through the drivers are found in our system drivers are found in your system we need to give path to the script okay ee drivers anevi mana system lo unnai we need to give path of that drivers to the script now here we have a static key to open chrome browser static key to open chrome browser the key is sorry web driver dot chrome dot driver web driver dot chrome dot drive now here i am using one system class system dot we have a system is a class and we have a one method called set property method the method name is set property like how i am getting this suggestions means use the control space control bar and space bar must and should you need to use control and space bar here i have a set property method set property method here it have a string key and value but first in the string we need to give double quotes and here we need to give that web driver dot chrome dot driver and here we have a we need to give path which path we need to open the chrome browser so we need to use chrome driver path here we are founding this chrome driver dot exe file right click on the file and properties option 
to the properties we have a location we need to copy this location control c and then control v now go to the semicolon go to the semicolon now we can go through move to web driver control space here i am doesn't getting any type of suggestions so to use the selenium to use this selenium jar without using selenium jar we can't be able to run the selenium program so we need to know how to build path let us observe guys here build path means nothing but we are adding these jars to the class path of the project okay right click on the project we are seeing the build path option to the build path we have a configure build path option to the configure build path option we need to click on the libraries we need to click on the libraries in the libraries we are seeing the class path option which option it is class path click on the class path and we have a add jars option which option it is add jars click on the add jars in the selenium basic project we have a jars folder in this jars folder we are seeing that selenium server click on that selenium server and now apply when we are applying this jars we need to refer here reference libraries was added or not when we know successfully the reference libraries are added successfully then only go to the apply and close apply and close now let us see here i am going through the web driver control space here we are seeing the web driver web driver is a interface we can't create direct object to the web driver so we need to use subclass now web driver i am giving a name as driver equal to new is the keyword creating to object new here i am approaching the chrome driver constructor which constructor it is chrome driver constructor why because we can't able to create a direct object to the interfaces okay now with using these two lines this line this line opens the browser this line opens the browser ee line em chestha ante idu run chesthe browser anedi open avutundi now control s yes. now i am click on this run option ikkada chudandi here i am seeing that run option just click on that run option here it was opened the like what it was open browser here the browser will be open automatically okay now i am closing this program okay now this is the program to open the browser and here i am uh, explaining another one method there is a get method to launch the url we have a get to method how we can use this get method means driver dot get this get should be giving that https colon www dot google dot com this is the one of the link to open the google browser it is a one of the link control yes now here i am saving the program and go through the run option when i am running this program so it was automatically opened this google like that way we can use lot of urls we can open automatically with using selenium program okay okay guys this is class for today this is the installation class 